Hello everyone, my name is Dee and welcome to Books and Quirks. It's finally Friday. This was a longer week. It seemed like a longer week, even though it was New Year's and we had Monday off. I just felt like, I don't know, I just felt like it was the longest week ever, but I'm so glad it's Friday. I'm going to show you the books that I will be reading this weekend. So first, just to get it out of the way, I will be continuing on, as I talk about every week, with London. I didn't get very far this week. Um, I only read about another 100 pages, so currently I am on page 340, so not very far at all. So I read like another 140 pages, I think. Not So a little bit more than I thought. But I still have very far to go in this mammoth of a book that is 11, over 1,100 pages. So, yeah, I'll be continuing on with that. And hopefully this week I, I read a little bit more than just the 100, another 100 pages. Um, because I am really enjoying it. It's really, really good. So, in the next book that I want to read this week that you saw in my January TBR is Manners and Mutiny by Gail Carriger. I'm finally going to finish this series. I absolutely love it, and I don't know why it's taking me so long to read the four books, <laughs> but it's just a really fun series. I think it's fun. It's steampunk, it takes place in Victorian London, and I just love the badass girls in these in these books. I just think they're really fun and great, and I'm excited to see how it's all going to end up once it once it finishes. And finally, I'm going to read the second book in the Immortal Danger series. I don't know if that's what the series is actually called. Let me see. So I think it's called the Immortal Danger series. I read this book last week. I really loved it and it ended on a huge cliffhanger. So I needed to pick up the second book right away. I couldn't just not not read it. So I'll talk about this book more in my wrap up that I'll film next, but I just am loving this book. Basically, just to give you a two line synopsis, it follows a young girl who is suicidal and she is given a deal by these immortal type beings um, where she can get some of her greatest desires or wishes granted, kind of like a genie, but not. Um, and as long as she agrees to like work for them afterwards and, and repay, um, repay those favors in a way. I'll talk about it more when I get, when I do my wrap up, like I said, but it's really a fun series. It's fantasy. It's just, it's paranormal. It's It has all of my favorite kind of things in it. So I'm really glad I picked that book up. And I will put a picture because I actually purchased the second book on my Kindle rather than a physical copy. So there you have it. I know this was a really quick Friday read, especially because I'm continuing on with London and I really do want to try to get a decent amount read this week. And I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all very soon. Bye.